you beat those kids from Wap from Wapple. And I think that happened right there at the, at the very end of the last 100 meters or 200 meters or something like that. How'd that go? Uh, yeah, I was basically playing was to stick to them as long as possible. Uh, I was feeling pretty good for, so for about the last 1,000 meters I surged a little bit and managed to hold them off then at the end, so I pretty happy. Did that feel pretty good to do that at the end? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I know uh, they got some speed at the end and I got some speed too, but I was feeling good and felt should push it there about halfway through that last mile. And tonight was almost a perfect night for yeah. you. Yeah, couldn't ask for much better conditions than this. And your team did great too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We, last two meets was a little bit of a struggle, but we built on that and focused on this race and definitely came out how we wanted to. Good job. You guys are just, uh, just edged IMS the other night, uh, and then I think you guys got them again tonight, probably by even more. Oh, yeah. is, that pretty, is that a pretty big deal for you guys? Um, I mean, it's nice too. We try to think of them as another team, but it's always nice to good competition between our schools. Always has been, so it's definitely good to come out. In that. So he was saying that uh, that Bill had a PR on the court or like a course record, and that, that you might have broken it too. Yeah, I think uh, I think I was a minute faster than last time on this course, and about ten seconds faster than that uh, from before. Talk about the, about the way Bill runs. He was he was. Yeah, I, yeah. He's right from there. the beginning, you could tell he, he wanted to end it in the first mile, and he basically did that. And uh, when, he, when you're that good, you know, you can you can do that. So I kind of let the Mosers go after him a little bit, and I think they got a little tired from that. So I tried to play off that. Yeah, I was sitting on the sand green.